Yo, what's going on guys? My name is Cameron and welcome to another video. Now today, first of all, I want to start by saying sorry I haven't uploaded this week or anything. But I had like tests a week and I had a driving lesson yesterday and that was like really tiring and stuff. So anyway, let's anyway, get into the game now. You know, this is another episode of uh, Road to England. I think this is like our seventh episode or something like that. But anyway, we come up against this guy called Saint FC here. And what EA were thinking when they paired me up with this guy, I don't know. They must have just thought, oh, he has a silver player, I have a silver team, let's match them up together and play. Okay, so I want to start off by saying as well that we're playing in Division 3 for this game. Or like, well, for both games, actually, because I couldn't find anyone on the online single matches. Probably the time of day that I was trying to play this game at. But yeah, anyway, getting into the game now. Uh, we start off here, Dwight Gale. You know, he's actually like pretty good and pretty strong when he's in front of the ball. Very unlucky there to get the goal. Felipe Luis there on the line saving him. A nice like bicycle kick there by Danny Ings, in fact. Anyway, here we have Sinclair running down the wing. Now, he's actually pretty good. He surprised me because I've had a few games where you know, he's not done well. But he does provide the assist there for Danny Ings getting his first of his um, career in Rota, England. So anyway, as we see here, yet again, Agbon Lahore. Honestly, his um, burst of pace like straight away is so good. And yet again, same thing, low driving cross into the box. Danny Ings is there. Hopefully, there's going to be plenty more goals for him in this series. You know, he seems to he turns out to be a lot better player than what I originally thought he was. And anyway, it wasn't exactly with Ufa all over this guy. Diego Costa there, you know, he had the chance missed, but it was offside. And anyway, here, look, he gives it to Felipe Luis. Felipe Luis gives it to Gary Cahill. And Gary Cahill, out of all people, strikes that one in. But you'll see in a replay in a second. How, what's his name? I can't even remember. Butland. It was like, was it like Jake Butland or something like that? How he doesn't save this, it's directly at him. Honestly, there's a lot of things wrong with Jake Butland. He isn't the best. Anyway, again to the second half. Stats there. Sorry I didn't pause it very long. But they weren't exactly like, um, you know, even. I'd say they're more so my-sided. But anyway, he literally just copies us there. He copies like both of our goals gets it in with Jesus Navas and Diego yeah, Diego Costa's there to slot that one away anyway Dwight Gale here very unlucky not to get the goal I think his record's still like 12 goals and like 9 games or whatever but Danny Ings there takes it round Courtois you know the goalkeepers are still completely fucked EA still haven't sorted them out will they ever probably not they don't honestly care most likely but anyway Danny Ings there making it free to making it sure that we do get the upgrade and I oh know we get another upgrade in fact actually because in fact that was Danny Ings hat trick Danny Ings hat trick and I oh know you never know you might not even get it we might not get the upgrades yet I've kind of given that one away but still anyway he just randomly fouls us there we do get a free kick here in fact yep Eric Dier you know, he's going to bring this one. I think that's like Townsend or Bon Lahore over there. The Bon Lahore, in fact. And as I was saying earlier about his burst of pace, look here, he just stops. Bang, beats the defender easily. Beats another defender. You know, yet again, I did, you know, basically the easiest thing. Honestly, I haven't tried it out yet. The low driving cross is just like triple tap um, square on PlayStation. I think that might be X on uh, Xbox. But anyway, confirmation now of the 4-2 win and the two upgrades. Gabby Bonlahor there, he did a great job. Danny Ings, yet again, also he did a great job as well. Anyway, as you see here, yeah, Danny Ings, four goals. Yeah, Gabby Bonlahor there, getting man of the match. Danny Ings, getting four goals. And yeah, anyway, confirmation of um, it being in seasons there with three points. Anyway, for the first two upgrades I've gone for, I went and replaced John Flanagan with Danny Rose. He has decent stats, 82 pace, 74 dribbling, along with 73 defending and physical. Then for the second upgrade, I went and replaced Kyle Norton with uh, Nathaniel Klein. Just like Rose, decent pace, decent dribbling, decent defending and decent physical. That just leaves us with Dwight Gale to upgrade now. I've left him to last because he's been an absolute great player for us. But anyway, yet again here... What are EA thinking when they're setting me up with players like, well, no, not players, teams like this? He has Suarez, Bale, Inform Neymar, Inform Rakitic, Team of the Year Ramos, and Inform Carvajal. Seriously, I don't know what EA are thinking when they're pairing me up with these players. And sorry as well about the um, pitch is um, snowy. I know it might be a bit hard to see the ball and that. But yeah, anyway, getting into the game now. We do get a free kick here. I think that's like Gabby Bonhoeffer winning it. When I start off this match, you know, so Eric De Eric Dier here, I'm very unlucky not to get the goal there. You know, I didn't realise he was very good at free kicks or whatever. But you know, Gabe Blondehoy, unlucky to get the goal. And I just say this now, to Sturgeon, whatever he was on, 
he was performing absolutely amazing. Look, another save here, there. Dwight going unlucky to get the goal. They're not exactly the best shots, but still. If that was Butland in goal, they, they, they would be going in, guaranteed. And, you know, Gabby Blonahu there, yet again. Unlucky there not to get the follow-up. But, yeah, anyway, we do get very, very lucky here. Diego Costa hits the post, and we do manage to clear it, though. The defence is very shaky in this team at the moment. So, I think that's going to be one of, like, the first, kind of, like, sets of upgrades in the gold side that we're going to do. Anyway, with how we didn't score that as well there, we were so unlucky. You know, Dwight Gale there, he literally just gave it to us. He gifted us the goal, but we couldn't take it. Anyway, nil nil at half time there. Very unlucky not to score a goal there, and very lucky not to concede actually. But anyway, straight away from half time, Iniesta gets through, and Iniesta does score. I was really annoyed at this point because you know we were both. It was a very even game to be honest. He was good at keeping possession. I was good at just you know kind of making chances out of what I could. And honestly, here, okay, look. Dwight Gale, he's unlucky to get the ball there, but was that really offside? Look, okay, so he gives the ball away about now, okay, no, not I'm thinking about the wrong thing, but look, in my opinion there, that is not offside. Like, I don't know what EA were thinking was offside, whether Dwight Gale was offside or what, but, you know, in my opinion, that isn't offside. I slowed it down, but anyway, very lucky here, yet again, not to concede 2-0 down. But anyway, gave it to Sinclair here, and we do get the confirmation of the loss. I'm pretty annoyed about that, but basically, because we're in Division 3, and because we came up against a good side, I decided that, you know, we should involve some handicaps, so I didn't decide to downgrade anyone. Anyway, guys, if you have enjoyed this video, please do leave a like and subscribe to be kept up to date with things, as usual, and for some reason, EA didn't give us any coins there. So yeah, anyway, stats there are pretty even as well, you know, 12 goals, no, 12 shots, 7 on target. He had 5-5, five and five, you know, it was very unlucky. But anyway, guys, if you have enjoyed the video, please do leave a like, as I said before. I hope you have a nice day. Peace.